the human appendix. Darwin said not only is the appendix uh, useless, and th the modern word for that is vestigial, but it is sometimes the cause of death. He wrote, on the view of descent with modification, we may conclude that the existence of organs in a rudimentary, imperfect, and useless condition, like the appendix, far from presenting a strange difficulty as they assuredly do on the ordinary doctrine of creation, after all, why would a creator make an animal with a useless organ? So Darwin argued it would, could be anticipated on his theory of descent with modification. But in 1900, British anatomist Richard Berry reported, on considerable evidence, that the human appendix is actually an important part of the immune system, which helps us to fight disease. Berry concluded that the appendix is not, therefore, a vestigial structure. Well, forget the evidence. The 2014 edition of Raven and Johnson's Biology tells students that the human appendix is apparently vestigial. It is difficult to understand vestigial structures such as these as anything other than evolutionary relics, holdovers from the past. According to University of Berkeley, uh, University of California Berkeley website, which was updated last year, all life bears the scars of its history, including humans. Our awkward wisdom teeth and appendix are simply historical holdovers that evolution has not managed to get, man managed to rid us of. Well, fortunately, because our immune system might be compromised if it had. Now, you can get by without your appendix if you have to have it removed. I had my tonsils removed when I was a kid, uh, and we have other systems that can back them up uh, in the immune system. But the fact is the appendix is known, not just based on Barry's work in 1900, to serve as a, a part of our immune system. It also serves as a safe house for beneficial bacteria. We need bacteria in our intestines to digest our food. After a serious bout of diarrhea, a person may lose all those beneficial bacteria, and the appendix can actually reseed the intestines and keep that person alive. So there are two known functions of the human appendix which are ignored by these evolutionary biologists. And the evidence was there for a long time. 